Now we are going to take a look at event alert. This addon shows you when you got procs on some attacks, for example killing machine on a decay or smash on warriors. Type in slash EA opt, which stands for event alert options, to configure it. Click at the button on the top to set the positions of the proc frames. Vortex Assist is a huge add-on, which I'm gonna use to show my diseases on my targets. As you can see, there are multiple bars which shows you information on your cooldowns, in this case also for soul stones, soul shards and stuff like that. Type in slash fx to open the add-on menu, where you can configure everything. Go to the character selection menu to disable some parts of the add-on. I play Death Knight, that's why I disable all the other class add-ons. I also disabled the cooldown add-on of Fort Exorcist because I don't like it. Deadly Boss Mods is a must-have add-on for every player. Type in slash dbm to open the add-on menu. The add-on basically shows you bars with cooldowns in it, so you will never miss something what's going on in the raid or in the battlegrounds. Hit the button Options to configure the bars. Click on the button Raid Warnings to set the colors of the bar. If you hit the Move Me button you can move the bars around. In the bar style options you can change the layout and the size of the buttons. On the main frame of the option menu you can test the add-on. The World of Warcraft Instant Messenger is one of my favorite add-ons. It simply shows you a chat window for every person you're gonna write with. Type in slash wim to open the add-on menu. I will just whisper myself something that you can see what does it look like. You can change the size and the colors in the instant messenger options. You can scale the window, change the font colors and set specific width and height for the windows. There are also some buttons in the chat window where you can add players, ignore them, invite to group or even look at their location. The more players you write with, the more windows will pop up. If you're in fight, they won't pop, but there will be a sign in the minimap button. You're never gonna miss whispers in the raid again. The next cool add-on is Opi. Type in slash Opi to open the add-on menu or just hit escape interface. You can set specific rings for everything. In this example I'm gonna create a mounts and pets ring. First of all, set the hotkey to open the button circle, and then put some mounts or pads, skills, keys or anything else into the circle and change the colors. This is what's gonna look like when you finish the configuration. Let's carry on with the tutorial and take a look at the add-on Mix Crawling Battle Text. Here is a small example that you can see how it looks like. As you can see, it shows you every damage source. It also shows your procs, buffs and when they fade away. To set up the add-on type in slash msbt. You can change the scroll areas by hitting the button Configure Scroll Areas. 
You can add scroll bars or delete them. After that you can change every single damage source to specific scroll areas. When you hit the button preview you can see where the text is going to pop up or fade away it depends on your settings. Here is the final result when you downloaded the Wii package. Enjoy!